Well, we have no written records from prehistory, uh, so we don't have documents of that type to prove uh, that women artists of the Neolithic period, the New Stone Age, uh, created artwork. However, there's every reason to believe that they did. Uh, we do have cultures that survive into the 19th and into the 20th century that essentially are still Neolithic cultures. Um, Australian Aborigines, Native Americans, uh, and other Native peoples. And in many of these cases, uh, there are traditional women's crafts, things like weaving and fabric design, basket making, and pottery uh, could be performed by women, as well as by men. Now, when I say Neolithic, uh, we're talking about uh, prehistoric cultures, cultures before written records, in which uh, the people have settlements, probably living in villages, and they're starting to create things like weaving fabric, or basket making, or <laughs> pottery. But they don't just create the most minimal, say, pot that will serve the purpose of holding something. Human beings seem to be driven to create uh, beauty, interest, and so as we'll see, the pottery comes in all different shapes and is embellished with decoration. So, yeah, we can call this art. I'm just going to show you a few examples that I found on the web. Uh, this is a Neolithic textile. It's said to be the oldest textile that still survives. Uh, it's a fragment of linen from Fayum, Egypt, and is supposed to date from about 5,000 BCE, or about 7,000 years ago. And of course, weaving is very often uh, a, a traditional woman's work and a traditional woman's craft. We have Neolithic pottery from uh, many countries. And I'm just going to show you a few. Uh, this is Neolithic pottery from Britain. And as you can see, it's made out of native clay. Um, I have two different shapes here. So, uh, you know, making interesting shapes. And then they have embellished the surface with decoration, uh, which, you know, isn't necessary to the function but helps create uh, a unique, uh, but more beautiful work. So here we have uh, incised lines uh, that, that create a texture and a pattern. Uh, perhaps a little more sophisticated and more col colorful are some uh, examples of Neolithic pottery from ancient Greece. Uh, and uh, as you can see, they're using uh, colored uh, clays, colored slips to create uh, uh, different patterns. And here are some uh, examples of Neolithic pottery from China uh, that are said to be uh, 5,000 to 3,000 years old. Now, we have no way of knowing whether the potter, or if there was a division of labor, the uh, person who uh, created the decorations, whether that person was male or female. Both males and females create pottery. But there's no reason to think that women did not create pottery, baskets, weaving, during the Neolithic period, and every reason to believe that women were part of cultures that created what we now call craft, but essentially could be utilitarian art and decoration.